नमस्कार आई एम डॉक्टर अखिल श्रीवास्तव एंड आई वेलकम यू ऑल इन द डेली वेदर ब्रीफिंग ऑफ इंडिया मेट्रोलॉजी डिपार्टमेंट टुडे ऑन ट्वेंटी सेकंड ऑफ सेप्टेम्बर ट्वेंटी फाइव वी विल हाउ वॉज द वेदर डूंग पास ट्वेंटी फोर आवर्स एंड वॉट वी एक्सपेक्ट इन टर्म्स ऑफ वेदर इन द कमिंग नेक्स्ट वन वीक इफ यू टॉक अबाउट द मेन हाईलाइट ऑफ टुडे देन अ लो प्रेशर एरिया हैज फॉर्म ओवर नॉर्थ ईस्ट बे ऑफ बंगाल टुडे एंड ऑल्सो अनदर लो प्रेशर एरिया इज लाइकली टू फॉर्म ओवर ईस्ट सेंट्रल एंड एट ज्वाइनिंग नॉर्थ बे ऑफ बंगाल अराउंड ट्वेंटी फिफ्थ ऑफ सेप्टेम्बर द साउथ ईस्ट मॉनसून हैज फर्दर विद ड्रॉन फ्रॉम सम मोर पार्ट ऑफ गुजरात Rajasthan, Haryana and Punjab. Today, conditions are becoming favorable for further withdrawal of southwest monsoon from some more parts of Gujarat, Rajasthan, Haryana and Punjab and some parts of Uttar Pradesh, Delhi, Himachal Pradesh, Jammu and Kashmir during next 2 to 3. If you talk about observe weather during the past 24 hours, then very heavy rainfall activity. That means the rainfall between 12 to 20 cm in a day in 24 hours period and ending in 24 hours period ending at 8:30 a.m. Then there is a possibility of rainfall in the morning. Then there is a possibility of rainfall in the morning. Then there is a possibility of rainfall in the morning. Then there is a possibility of rainfall in the morning. Then there is a possibility of rainfall in the morning. Then there is a possibility of rainfall in the morning. Then there is a possibility of rainfall in the morning. Then there is a possibility of rainfall in the morning. Then there is a possibility of rainfall in the morning. Then there is a possibility of rainfall in the morning. Then there is a Nadu and Telangana. Heavy rainfall that is rainfall between 7 to 11 cm in 24 hours period ending at 8:30 hours IST of today morning was reported at isolated places over West Madhya Pradesh, East Rajasthan, Odisha, Jharkhand, Tripura, North India Karnataka and coastal Andhra Pradesh. If it about main synoptic condition which are impacting India today, then the low pressure area as already shown in the highlights has formed over northeast Bay of Bengal and neighborhood and uh, it is likely to move west north westwards during next 24 hours towards northwest bay of bengal the another low uh, fresh low pressure area is likely to form over east central and adjoining north bay of bengal around 25th of september moving west north westwards it is likely to become a depression over northwest and adjoining west central bay of bengal off south odisha and north andhra pradesh coast around 26th of september it is likely to cross uh, south odisha and north andhra pradesh coast around 27th of september This is also a trough which runs from the cyclone circulation associated with low pressure area over northeast Bay of Bengal to North Karnataka across central parts of Bay of Bengal and Andhra Pradesh and Telangana in lower middle tropospheric levels. If we talk about other tropic systems then an upper air cyclone circulation lies over central parts of coastal Andhra Pradesh and another one over South Tamil Nadu and neighborhood in middle tropospheric levels. In lower tropospheric level a cyclone circulation is also seen over northeastern parts of Uttar Pradesh and neighborhood. With respect to monsoon withdrawal the uh, south west monsoon has withdrawn from some more parts of gujarat rajasthan haryana and punjab today it is 22nd of september and it is likely uh, the conditions are likely to be favorable for further withdrawal of south west monsoon from some more parts of gujarat rajasthan haryana and punjab some parts of uttar pradesh delhi himachal pradesh jammu and kashmir during next 2 to 3 days the line of withdrawal south west monsoon now passes through taran taran in punjab sangrur jind revari in himachal in haryana Tonk in Rajasthan, Mahesana, Porbandar in Gujarat. If you talk about the weather warning for next five days, then today, that is on 22nd of September, I should versus heavy to very heavy rainfall activity. A warning has been uh, issued for Gangetic West Bengal, Odisha, Marathwada, and Madhya Maharashtra. Heavy rainfall is expected over uh, I should versus over Gujarat region, eastern uh, parts of Rajasthan, West Madhya Pradesh, in as that Chhattisgarh, Telangana, coastal Andhra Pradesh, Tamil Nadu, Kerala, Konkan, and Goa. In northeastern parts, heavy rainfall is Extra surplus is expected over Nagaland, Manipur, Mizoram, Tripura subdivision, particularly in the Tripura subdivision. If we talk about day two, that's 23rd of September. Then isolated places have to very heavy rainfall activity. A warning is issued for Odisha, and heavy rainfall is likely over Gangetic West Bengal, Jharkhand, Chhattisgarh, coastal Andhra Pradesh, Telangana, Marathwada, Madhya Maharashtra, North India, Karnataka. Also in the northeastern parts of the country, Assam and Meghalaya, and Nagaland, Manipur, Mizoram, Tripura are expected to receive. I should have been in for activity. If we talk about day three, that is on 24th of September, then I should places heavy to very heavy rainfall activity. Warning has been issued for Chhattisgarh with the orange alert, and also I should heavy rainfall activity with yellow alert is issued for uh, Assam and Meghalaya, Nagaland, Manipur, Mizoram, Tripura, Jharkhand, Odisha, coastal Andhra Pradesh, North Interior Karnataka, Vidarbha. And the thunderstorm warning has been issued for Central India, particularly in the Madhya Pradesh, adjoining East Rajasthan, um, Marathwada, Madhya Maharashtra, and other places in the northern parts of South and South India. If it about day four, that on 25th of September, an isolated presence heavy to very heavy rainfall uh, warning has been issued for Odisha, Chhattisgarh, coastal Andhra Pradesh, and heavy warning, heavy rainfall warning has been issued for Bihar, Jharkhand, Vidarbha, Telangana, Madhya Maharashtra. And in Konkan and Goa, in northeastern parts of the country, Assam and Meghalaya, Meghalaya is expected to receive isolated heavy rainfall activity on 25th of September. That is day five from now. That is on 26th of September. Isolated heavy to very heavy rainfall activity is likely over Odisha, coastal Andhra Pradesh, Madhya Maharashtra, and Konkan and Goa. In addition to that, heavy rainfall is likely over Bihar, Chhattisgarh, Telangana, 
मराठवाड़ा नॉर्थ इंडिया कर्नाटका रायल सीमा एंड ऑल्सो इन साउथ इंडिया कर्नाटका कोस्टल कर्नाटका tamilnadu and kerala on day 6 that is on 27th and uh, of uh, september i should have in for activities likely over odisha chatisgarh coastal andhra pradesh telangana vidarbha maharashtra state uh, karnataka state and also in uh, tamilnadu kerala and in rajasthan metrological subdivisions if we talk about day 7 that is on 28th of september then i should have in for activity in north eastern parts of the country expected over nagaland manipur and some tripura subdivision and also in i should press over odisha chatisgarh coastal andhra pradesh vidarbha north india karnataka south india karnataka coastal karnataka konkan goa and madhya maharashtra metrological subdivisions if we talk about the uh, uh, fisherman warning due next 7 days then southwest arabian sea uh, squally winds uh, with the speed of 45 to 55 km per hour gusting to 65 km per hour is likely during next 5 days uh, particularly over southwest arabian sea and uh, during next 24 hours in the adjoining regions of west central arabian sea these are the warnings for today we will uh, for any updated information you can uh, visit imd social media handle and imd website along with the different applications like mosom app on uh, the uh, different uh, phones thank you very much namaskar jai hind